In May 2020, outspoken poet and musician Ntiki Mazwai accused popular media personality Somizi Mithongo of conspiring to kill her brand. Ntiki said, Somizi set up a cross to destroy her brand and image allegedly because gay men have hatred for alpha females and seem to be always competing against them. Ntiki accused Somizi of setting her up because he is insecure about alpha females. She went on to suggest that gay men have issues with alpha females because of what she quoted as vagina envy. Tiki Mazwa is not stopping at all. In November 2020, sis Jack Somizi, who was probably sleeping in his expensive bed in his luxurious mansion. Meanwhile, Tiki made sure to let everyone know what she thinks of Somizi. What could have been a peaceful day turned out to be a very unpeaceful one on the Twitter street. Simply because Ntiki Mazwai decided to drag Somizi again. Tiki being her usual self didn't hold back at all and told everyone exactly what was on her mind. Lo, it's cute if you think people like Somizi will make history, maybe the old Somizi who had a craft. But the new Somizi is just gonna be rich in this lifetime but won't make history. Money and wealth doesn't make history unless you created something. Capitalism gave us celebrities to distract us from real issues affecting us. Who is the Somizi of white people or is just us who celebrate empty vessels who shout loudly? It is still not clear why Ntiki decided to attack Somizi who is yet to respond. But she clearly couldn't care less about what he might think or say. Poor Som Gaga isn't the first celeb that Ntiki decided to throw major shade at. A few days ago, she dragged Cesar Slomo for being privileged. We wouldn't be surprised if Ntiki Mazwai has a list of celebrities who have offended her in the past and she is dealing with them one by one. This time was just Somizi's turn. The two have a history of insulting each other and everyone in the industry knows that. They don't like each other at all. Hopefully one day they will crush their beef and Ntiki can be invited to dinner at Somizi's. Until then, we will watch from the sidelines.